village in Germany. The young boy was called Felix. In 2007, Felix picked this idea and decided to start a project called Plant for the Planet. That boy alone planted one million trees and caused his age to plant one billion trees. Now they are thinking of planting one trillion trees. Mayo comes, Mayo comes from or grew up in the same town where I grew up. In Elred, in the 90s, in the morning you would meet runners practicing. These days you don't see them. They have moved away. So I was asking somebody why. I was asking Professor Sobe because recently he organized a road race in Everett and the prices were 23 million. I asked him, what happened? He said the runners have run away to Cap Cap Taggart Forest and he did. Why? He said the research has shown that they run well in an environment with adequate oxygen. Eldred does not have oxygen because we cut all the trees that Etek had planted. So among the things they were doing was to plant one million, plant and grow one million trees. Because when you plant a tree, it can die. So you commit to plant and grow it. So, Anzalimu, how about you? As an individual, can you do something to change? You know, these people have been throwing challenges at us. Can we as individuals decide? Edome was also my student. Edome, <coughs> you have a personal food policy in your house. Because if you cannot feed your family throughout, then you have no personal food policy. And don't just feed them on chips. You people don't know how to say no to your children. You go to a supermarket and you wonder, what's wrong with this? The child says, I want chips. I want sausage. But today, you have been told, if you allow your children to take more than one spoon of sugar, you are responsible for their future problem. Do you have those rules and regulations? If I have to take sugar sometimes, I take it in my office. And I have to convince my secretary very well. I tell her stories and she will allow me. Otherwise, she doesn't allow me. But at home, if I put tea in my cup, that tea will be poured away. That's the kind of thing that we need to remain healthy and to keep this environment. So ladies and gentlemen, we're so happy that you came and met this thing success. So together we can hold hands and change the environment around us, the community around us, the county around us, change Kenya, Africa, and the whole world. So with those few remarks, I wish you journey masses. Let's meet again next year or earlier in another international conference. Ah, no, I don't want this thing to end, so I don't want to say it was. But I think, ladies and gentlemen, anything good has an expiry date. Our expiry date has come. So may I, with all respect, declare this fourth Baby University International Conference officially closed. Let's welcome to the Vice Chancellor. Take the opportunity to invite uh, one of our valued researchers who recently returned from a conference in Birmingham, uh, England. Uh, uh, Dr. In Waiting, Irene Simil, to move forward and pass a mobile vote of thanks. Irene Simil. Please step forward.
our Vice Chancellor, our DBCs, our Deputy Principal, Chukana University, our fellow our conference participants. Good afternoon. Again, I don't want to be the only thing between you and your lunch. Therefore, allow me to move a brief vote of thanks. I want to begin by appreciating God for his mercies and grace in enabling us to create knowledge, share it, and interrogate it. We say, may the name of the Lord be praised. To our sponsors for supporting this great venture by partnering with scholars, we say Asante Sana. Our keynote speakers for sharing great wisdom and knowledge gathered over many years of experience. I agree that experience is the best teacher. However, it doesn't have to be mine. I can learn from someone else's experience. Again, we say Asante Sana. To the presenters from this region and beyond, I want to say that great minds have interacted in these two and a half days. We want to say that may this be our pattern and may we continue. To Kibabi University, the plant uh, platinum sponsors of this fall international conference, I want to say that in keeping with our motto, knowledge for development, we have been able to do this. And I want to say that to everyone that supported this great venture, may you continue and may you be encouraged. To the Secretariat, Catering Unit, our able uh, photographers, especially Felix, who is our journalism student, and to all who are uh, not mentioned, I want to say Asante Sana and let us meet in the fifth international conference. God bless you. Thank you, Ms. Mamashetra. As we close, I want to recognize my QMC, Dr. Catherine Lana. Please stand in the upstanding. Let's appreciate her. Thank you, Dr. Well done. Zote Tasimamo Katifu, Ili Tueze Kuimbo Kuimbo Wataifa. Fast starts at the start.
there, and that you continue uniting us as you started. I pray all this believing and trusting in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, just before we meet, a uh, very quick announcement. Plan to be signed with the Mount Papa's Fourth International Conference here at Trouble University this year 2018. They are 2019, and therefore, we must all come next time to invite you to come and give it by the numbers. Thank you, and God bless you. Oh, my God. 